Welcome back to Reset Games. Welcome back. We're back. We're back with the most elite playthrough of Sonic. Oh. Some more Sonic. I'm doing terribly. Those things look like fucking robotic traffic cones. They basically are. <laughs> They're basically nothing more than that. They just shoot little energy things. And that's like death goop. I don't yeah. even know what that is. Silly putty. Blue. Yeah, it's killer putty. <laughs> Killy putty. That's Puns it. That's what funny. it is. Puns are funny. I agree. Damn it. So, I'm going to tell you a story. When I was a kid, like a, a little, maybe five or six or so, apparently I really, really liked the movie Titanic. Oh my god. Which really? I hate now. Yeah. Yeah. I really I liked it when I was a kid, though. Thing. Really? Yeah. That's weird. I know. I That's think I tried weird. once and I was like, um, no. <laughs> no. <laughs> but anyway, sorry. No, it's okay. I um, I but apparently I only really liked part two, which was the ship sinking. <laughs> yeah. And I don't remember this very well, but my mother and sister both consistently tell me that I would wake up in the morning, mm -hmm. and the first thing I would do is go wake up my sister, and I would ask her if we could watch Jack and Woes. Oh. Yes. That's adorable. Jack, and, let's watch Jack and, Jack and Woes. Jack and Woes. <laughs> yeah. I only like part two, apparently. Yeah. And I called it Jack and Woes. I'll never know why. That's hilarious. What? Oh, gosh. The internet will never let me live now. Have you ever been on a giant cruise ship? No. Me either. Actually, I've been on a cruise ship, but not a big one. Uh, I am petrified of the ocean. Me too. It's fucking terrifying. I know. Like, I the mean, ocean is the scariest thing. It doesn't help that I can't really swim, but... Yeah. Oh, you can't swim? No. I can swim, and I'm black. <laughs> like, that's a stereotype. We can't do that. Really? But, yeah, apparently. <laughs> I didn't even know that was a thing. Oh, apparently. Every time I tell people I can swim, they're like, really? And I'm like, yes. Look at my fucking feet. <laughs> like, I swim well. Uh, yeah, and, like, I don't... I, I, I don't think I would want to swim, either. Really? Like, I mean, unless I have to. I feel like if I had to, though, if I, if I was gonna die, like, my body would realize how to swim... Probably. Yeah. <laughs> I think, like, in a life or death situation, like, yeah. you can only do so much. God damn it. So. I'm not too concerned. I, I went on a, on, a, on a whale watch once. So did I. Mm-hmm. And I've never been in a boat since then, because fuck that. Yeah. But I got incredibly seasick. Oh. Like, yeah. ridiculously seasick. Because, like, it was just, the, it was a bad day to do it. Mm hmm Like, the waves were ridiculous. The wind was all over the place. It was not fun, and I was, like, sick the whole time. Oh. And so was, like, 90% of everyone else. Did you throw up? I don't even remember. I mm -hmm. feel like I probably did. All I know is I've never wanted to go on a boat since then. Shit sucks. The it sucks a lot. feel like the longest shit. Like, I remember the last one I went on. I've been on two. The last one I went on was so fucking long. We were, like, driving? I don't know. No, sailing? Whatever you call it. We were going out for like. When you're probably, in the water, it is sailing, I believe. Yeah. <laughs> I don't think like you drive a on water. Sailboat, so like I don't, I don't know. Anyway, we were sailing out for like three hours, and it was like three hours back. It was fucking exhausting. Like I, I'm so afraid of drowning to death. Me too. There's nothing scarier to me. That's like the second least, the second worst way I would want to die. What's the first? Burning to death. Real, oh, yeah, I guess burning to death is pretty shitty, too. Yeah. But I feel like after a, sh a short while of being burning to death, like, you'll stop feeling it. That's true. But you'll just be conscious enough to realize you're still burning That's to death. True. But Because, like, your nerves would probably burn out. And yeah. And you feel it anymore. Yeah. But, like, drowning the whole time, you're conscious for that. You're suffocating. You're in the oh. middle of nowhere. Yeah. A shark could come. You could drown. Like, you're getting hypothermia is so scary to me I think me. I'd actually rather a shark come and like end my misery cause I feel like <laughs> suffocating to death would just be so terrifying yeah actually um, I think I agree yeah but I just don't want to get eaten by anything yeah like I feel like being anything else is dinner is just not fun yeah so especially not when you're already dying yeah well shout out to anyone who's ever drowned and been eaten to death <laughs> shout out to all them dead people <laughs> <laughs> oh the ocean what a scary thing yeah i can't even imagine like all the species we haven't um 
discovered yet in the ocean? Oh, there must be so many. There's gotta be some terrifying shit down there. There's no way there's not, like, actual demon fish that live at the bottom of the ocean. Like, like huge fucking... Imagine, like, the guy who discovered the first octopus. Like, he's probably like, what the <laughs> fuck Oh, is this? oh, <laughs> what? <laughs> it's like, o- octopuses are weird. They Octopi. Are weird. Octopi. They're almost as weird as peni. Yes. There's, there's, there's few things yeah. that are weirder than peni, though. Yes, very few. I think many organs of the body are weird. Yeah. Body, about, bodies are weird, yeah, just like, in we're general. Yeah, so ugly, if you think about it. What are humans, even? I know, like, what a weird animal we are. And, like, how, we're fucking, so fucking, how weird. fucking selfish, too. Like, we're so self-entitled of an animal. Like, you don't see monkeys, like, fucking building their own, like... <laughs> Monuments to yes, themselves. Like, like, wow, you did really good. Yeah, I've, I've always thought about that. Like, yeah. what makes a human think it's, like, that much mm. better than anything else? I don't think until we can actually have, like, real space travel that we're all that great. Yeah. Like, once we can sail through the cosmos and meet other aliens. I know. Because there are like, aliens. Stop cutting NASA's funding. We're not really that Yeah. <laughs> Ooh, science, it's dumb. We don't need that. Learning is for nerds. <laughs> Shit. I'm the worst right now. Huh, let's put all this money into the Catholic Church instead. <laughs> mm. <laughs> There's nothing I love more than reading fairy tales. <laughs> Got too political for a second. Hey, man. It's okay. Religion is dumb. <laughs> Power to anyone out there that is religious and doesn't yeah. cram it in everyone else's face. You're the kind of person I yeah, want to party with. Yeah, if you with. use it to better your life, I'm so happy for But if you me. tell your kid they're going to burn in hell if they don't do this, I hate you. Like, um, recently I watched um, the movie He Named Me Malala. It's about um, Malala. She won the Peace Prize and, like... She's Pakistani, and she stood up for um, the girls in Pakistan who like, really? couldn't get an education because of the Taliban. And, like, she, I mean, she practices Islam, and, like, she she was shot by the Taliban for, like, standing up for the girls. Of course. And it was crazy, because in the movie, she was like, I'm not mad at the guy who shot me at all. Like, Islam teaches us to forgive. Man. Like, isn't that amazing? That's amazing, but like <laughs> I could never subscribe to that. <laughs> Like, I'd be no, like, fuck that guy, he shot me. <laughs> I know. I like, agree. I'm not going to forgive him. But, he could have done anything else. <laughs> but yeah, like, it's just, I mean, I guess that's, like, if you're that happy practicing a religion, that's good. I have zero problem with religious people. If that's, like, I always say it, if that's how you get through the day, that's fine. If you yeah. believe in it and you genuinely believe it, that's your thing. That I don't have a problem with that. I just have a problem with it when people... Like, yeah. start sham- shoving it in other people's faces and tell their the kids they're going to burn in hell. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Like... No, no, don't attack me, Taliban. Don't... Yeah, Taliban, come at me, bro. I'll fight all of you. Yeah. Just oh, don't shoot me. No. <laughs> like, let's get into some swordplay, and then... Then we shall see. Yeah, but, like... I just... I just don't like people that are like, do this, or you're going to burn eternally in this horrible furnace of death. Like, that's so counterintuitive to what it is that you're trying to actually do. So I don't get it. You can say anything else. You'd be like, yo, dude, Christianity is mad cool, yo. You get these free sunglasses if you join. We got jackets, too. They can make leather jackets or anything. Mm -hmm. Not that I'm going to burn in hell. That sounds so (laughs) shitty. (laughs) Why would anyone want that? But I don't know. You just got to strive for happiness. I am just a... feel. Yeah, happiness is... Happiness is the thing, yo. That's what that's what makes life go round. Yeah. Not the world. Just make it worthwhile. Cause really, what even is anything? Mm. Like, <laughs> anyone <laughs> anyone could just make up anything, and then if people believe it, it's now a thing. Mm-hmm. I know. We should do it. We should. The cult of Peni. Yeah. That's absolutely <laughs> a thing now. All of you, shit. All of you out there, uh, please. Like and subscribe our video and our channel and tell us that we're great and join the cult of Peni. What are the perks, you ask? <laughs> I'm glad you asked. I will, I will tell you. You get a, uh, 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 you get a one-month subscription to nothing. <laughs> uh, I just did the same fucking thing. You get a leather jacket. It's not made of real leather. It's made of air. But you can pretend it's leather. Mm-hmm. And it's got a cool design. Yep. It's a little tag inside it that says mm-hmm. cult of Peni. Yep, cult of Peni. And, um... 
It's made of 100% polyester <laughs> fucking... I thought you were going to say 100% peanut. <laughs> yes, I should have said that. It's definitely made of 100% peanut. That's for certain. Um, yeah, the cult of peanut. Tell your friends, tell your family. What we, do we believe in, I'm we certain you're... We don't discriminate. What, yeah, People no. Without peanut, I can definitely... In fact, women are the most welcome. Yeah. <laughs> women are more welcome than men in the cult of peanut. <laughs> We're talking about the cult of Peni. Yep. What do we believe in? We believe in Peni. <laughs> that's it. That's all. Yes. That's yeah. That's really it. We mm-hmm. just believe that that's the way things should be said. And if you don't know what Peni is, then well, look it up. It's like you can't be in the cult. Yeah, exactly. You you have to know what Peni is. That's the one question we ask. When yeah, we try that's to the enter. that's the one question that needs to be answered consistently yep. and is not answered because. So. No one now. No one leave a comment explaining what it is because this needs to be top secret. Yeah, it's absolutely like if you're in the cult of Peni, the only rule of Peni is you can't tell other people what Peni is. If they want to become a member of Peni, then they can do that, but they have to pass the Peni initiation. What is the Peni initiation? Well, I can't tell you, actually. Yeah. You, you have just, to. Yeah. You just you just know you'll know when it happens. Yeah. If you if you all want to search www.cultofpeni.com, <laughs> there's a little survey you can fill out for more information and well, uh, not us, but you'll be contacted soon. After. You'll be you'll be contacted by one of the um, inaugural Peni. Yeah, official Peni members. There's a we have a hierarchy of Peni. Mm-hmm. You know, the Grand Peni. Yeah. We'll put the link in the description just so you have an easy way. So you can have an easy time, yeah. yeah it, okay, it'll make yeah. it better for everyone. But until then, join us next time on Reset Games. Please like, comment, and subscribe if you like what you've seen here today. And if you do not, please know that at some point in your near future, you're going to be walking down the sidewalk on a rainy day, and a car is going to drive by and splash water all over your nice pants. All over you. All over. So you better fucking... Like it. <laughs> Bye. We just experienced um Andrew's rage. <laughs> Real Andrew rage. That was the most genuine. <laughs> Did you see him throw his arms up? That was. Oh, I wish I could relive that for the rest of my life. That makes me. That makes me happy. But I'm also suppressing genuine rage as well. <laughs> I can tell.